Hi, this is Paul. I want to do a quick video on how to do release velocity modulation in the upcoming version of Surge. This should be in the 1.64 release that'll happen in December 2019, I hope. I have here the init patch set up with the modulator switch to sign, and our standard type of modulation velocity still works. So let me pick velocity here and then go ahead and modulate like the feedback or something like that. So, da -da -da. okay, great. So now, exactly what we expect. As I play on my device harder and harder, the feedback increases. Now, release velocity is a little different, so let me go here and increase the release of my overall envelope. All right, so I have a nice long release where I can hear. What I'm going to do is I'm going to go to the velocity control here, and it's special in 164 because we don't have any more room down here. So I'll right-click and choose switch to release velocity, and now it becomes release velocity. I'll then activate this as a modulator, and you'll see feedback is no longer modulated, because I'm actually modulating something different than velocity, which is release velocity. And I'll take pitch and move it all the way up here. Great. So now in that modulation, if I right mouse, I see I have a velocity to feedback and a release velocity to pitch modulation. So if I go ahead and play, if I do a quick release, I get that. If I do a slow release, right. so my release velocity is matched. Now release velocity is unipolar, and so my, at, assigning it to pitch is a little peculiar. So we could do a trick where we, you know, clear the release velocity uh, routings, um, grab an LFO, set its magnitude to zero, um, use that to modulate pitch, and at this point, nothing happens, but then go back up here to velocity, switch it to release velocity, modulate the LFO, I'm sorry, activate modulation, modulate the LFO by clicking on the little magical arrow, and then go ahead and increase the magnitude. And so then that vibrato, and let me increase the rate of that a little, It's, its intensity changes with my release velocity as well. And of course, then you can do all the standard things you want to do with an LFO, like applying envelopes so it comes and goes. Hope that's useful.